What is up, YouTube? It is your boy John here from Pool of Plow Plants More Farming Simulator 22. We're back on Four Legs by Stevie. Yes, I'm wearing a straw hat. I don't really know why. Anyway, let's get to it. All right. We're here. Man, my head is really tall in this. In this. My head does not go all the way up there. I swear it stops about, well, right, right about, okay. Anyway. <laughs> I should have I should have checked my camera before stream to make sure my fat head was gonna fit. I didn't think to do that. Man, it's way up there, isn't it? What difficulty? We always play on easy. As far as our economy difficulty, yeah. Uh usually easy because, you know, I don't like to take, you know, six years to play a map or anything, you know what I mean? Rocks, what's going on? Hello. How are ya? <laughs> Welcome in. This looks right. Uh, okay, so everything, uh, let's check precision. Everything's looking, you know, we actually should lime this field. That's what I should do. I need to lime that field. Dang it, we should have done that last night when I had help. Okay. That's all right. That's all right. By the way, chat, look at this spreader. Manure spreader. Four axles. This is the one that came out with the big buds back in the day. Back in the, oh, there's two of them, yeah. Oh, Dave's here to help. Let's go, Dave. Coming in clutch. Let's go, Dave. All right, I'm going to grab the uh, the big horse. The new big horse. Coming in clutch, Dave. Helps is on its way. Let's go. You want to grab some kind of tender for uh, lime, if you don't mind, Dave? I'll grab the pro force and head to the field. I'll fill it up before I go, though. I'll be kind. I'll be kind. I'll rewind. Wait, none of you youngins know what that means. Be kind, rewind. Yo, Chuck, you're not wrong, man. Um, There we go. I was like, why won't it work? I'll tell you what, Chuck, and, and I'm being serious when I say this, but like the the new guys that came in uh, with the bail challenge, so that would be Dave and, and John. Um, Coach was in a few times. We'd love to have him back, but like the, the new guys that came in with the, uh, with the bail challenge have just been fantastic, you know? They have. Sixteen thousand liters of hay and made nineteen hundred dollars. Toodaloo! Wait, <laughs> there you go, rocks. Yo, Yulebear, you like my hat? It's pretty sick, America. <laughs> see if I keep my head down. You can, well, you can't even see me. I'm like in the witness protection group. Oh, I'm like the reverse Mr. Wilson. <laughs> you can't see my eyes. <laughs> Got to remember to keep my head up today, you know? Don't let anything get me down today, chat. Got to keep my head up, you know? Well, man. Uh, lines, hello? Hello, lines? There you are. Hello, lines, my old friend. All right, let's go. Technically, this tractor does not go fast enough for this spreader, but that's okay. That's okay. Oh, man. But yeah, I'm like the reverse. Howdy, neighbor. Reverse Mr. Wilson. <laughs> oh, man. Yulberry, you can find this hat on Amazon.com. Just saying. Lagerbert, what's up? How you doing? I don't have an Amazon store or anything, but you can you can find it on Amazon. Saying? It's a thing. I own several of them because I got one here at the house. Actually, I had this one here at the house for uh, putting up Christmas lights and taking Christmas lights down. Um. Uh, showed you why I love precision so much. Why is that? It's because it's more realistic. Because that's that's one of the reasons I like it so much. It's so much more realistic. You use less products too. I feel like. 
as far as uh, fertilizer and lime and stuff. Mostly fertilizer, but lime a little bit as well. So, yeah. It's a whole thing. But this will be good to get this field done, and uh, then we'll be on to uh, fast timing, I assume. I think that's the next thing we have to do. I'm pretty sure, anyway. Rots. But, yep. This hat came off of uh, Amazon. You betcha. Trying to... Oh, that's GPS, not not precision. Precision's the, like... Uh, the mapping and stuff. The variable rate seed fertilizer, all that stuff. Uh, Biggie, I just switched to it. I, I'm... I switched to earbuds last night. I don't like them necessarily, but I think I'm going to be rocking them for a little bit. I still have my headphones. And actually, the funny thing is everybody last night, Biggie, said that my haircut looked good. I haven't cut my hair in like like a couple months probably. And actually, it was funny because last night after stream, you know, I ate dinner and eventually I went in the house to like take a shower, you know, go to bed. And I'm standing in the bathroom... And there's a big mirror on one wall in the bathroom, obviously, right? It's a bathroom. It has a mirror. And I'm looking and I'm going, I could actually use a haircut. <laughs> I'm like, I, I might want to, like, cut my hair soon, actually. <laughs> oh, man. I thought it was hilarious. I'm like, I could actually cut my hair right now and be all right with it. Oh, made at chili cheese dogs. Very nice, Chess. Sounds awesome. Sounds good. I know, right, Chuck? Dude, it cracked me up last night. That was so funny. Everybody's like, I don't know what's different. So, yeah, good haircut. Like, it's not. But I did. Just not wearing headphones, that's all. And it does, I mean, I look like a different person, though, I feel like, you know, a little bit. But like you said last night, Chuck, you know, just don't comment on somebody's appearance. Let somebody else do it, <laughs> you know. That yeah, must be hair. <laughs> oh, man. Or when somebody's like, oh, you look good. And it's like, well, what did I look like before? <laughs> you saying I looked like crap earlier? Thanks. Appreciate it. Oh, man. Uh, Chad, speaking of food, I had, uh, I know this is very local to me, but, you know, whatever. Uh, last night for dinner was was the, the good at St. Louis thin crust pizza with the Provel cheese and double pepperoni. Oh, my goodness. It's so good. I might have had, like, heartburn on light from it, but that's, so, that's, it's worth it. It was, it was so tasty. It was so tasty. So yummy. So I had a little bit before stream and then last night after stream, which is pretty much normal uh, dinner time for me. Oh, man, it was so good. And you have a slice. Okay, so they, they square cut it, right? So each pizza probably has, like, I don't even know. There's a ton of slices. I'll give you more than a slice because a slice is, like, it's, like, the size of, like, a... Like a big ravioli, you know? All price to pay, exactly. It was worth it. <laughs> Hoyt 2016 just resubscribed for 66 months. Yo, Hoyt coming in with the 66 month resub. You probably know about St. Louis style pizza, don't you, Hoyt? I had me some good old St. Louis pizza last night. Saying, fantastic. I don't even know what that is, Dave, but all right. Good. Eggs and chorizo. I've never had chorizo. Oh, definitely, Chuck. Yeah, you couldn't cut this in, like, triangles and have, like... Uh, you couldn't hold it. It would just fall apart. You have to square cut it, yeah. And chorizo from scratch. Oh, wow. Seasoned sausage. Okay, it always looks really spicy to me, and I don't know why. I don't know why. 
Yes, I do. There you go. It is, you know, the, the Emos. Emos is the St. Louis uh, brand of pizza, right? That's the, that's the famous St. Louis pizza is, is called Emos. That's not the one that we get because to me there's a better one that's like very local to me so i don't mention it on stream but their slogan is the square beyond compare that's literally their slogan and spicy even okay i gotcha yeah so it's it's definitely interesting yeah you you have to square cut it so Eggs with Mexican sausage. Now that? Okay. All right. I'm down. Good. <laughs> That's not good, Jess. <laughs> what are you allergic to in there? The, the spices or the... Uh, allergic to something, huh? That's, that could be a problem. Trent, what's up from the 4020? How are you? I saw your picture in Discord before. Look like you need some rain to keep the dust down for you. I feel like you're uh, eating dust a little bit today, but I could be wrong. Spices, okay. Ah, interesting. Oh, oh my God! I saw a grilled cheese sandwich like like a, a, a spin on it the other day on TikTok, and I kind of want to try it now. Snap's getting annoyed. No. no. I saw a grilled cheese sandwich, but they made it like French toast. And what I mean by that is they took a bowl of tomato soup and they dipped the bread in the tomato soup before making the grilled cheese sandwich. So it was kind of like dipped and then like... I don't know why my tractor just stopped right there, but all right. Uh, we'll just stop, Dave. We'll just stop. We got this. Uh, but they would dip the bread in the grilled cheese like a French, or dip the bread in the tomato soup, like making a grilled, or uh, like French toast, but, you know, tomato soup instead of, like, egg. And then throw it right in the pan, and, and, and I kind of want to try that, but it's not really, like, grilled cheese and tomato soup season. I feel like that's a cold or cooler weather, like, time of year, you know? It's too hot for that now. But I kind of want to try it, you know? So, like, your bread has the, oh... You know, I saw it on TikTok. It must be good <laughs> or something like that. There's a win, so it's not okay. I got you, Trent. I got you. I get Thursday. You know, it is only going to be in the 70s Thursday, so I'll probably be miserable out here. But yeah, I need a rain. Yeah, and it's not going to happen, Trent. That's the sad part. That's the sad part. That's a good idea, though. I think even Dad... See, Dad, Dad's weird, man. Dad's weird. I'm just throwing that out there. He likes tomato soup, but he can't stand, like, sauce on pizza. <laughs> you know, it's like, Dad, it's tomatoes. Yeah, Bear? But have you put the, the bread in the soup first before you grill it up? Because that sounds awesome saying stunt food I, I don't know oh, I mean I saw it on TikTok like I, like I said it can't be bad right can't be bad oh, 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 oh. and then God forbid you put a tomato in front of dad oh heck no which I don't blame him on that because like Yes, it comes from tomato, but it, it tastes totally different. You know what I mean? So, I eat tomatoes sometimes. I'm not a huge tomato guy. But, like, I, I can eat them if they're on something, you know? Just saying. Like, if I get a Jimmy John sandwich, I do not customize it. I get it. I'll eat the tomatoes on there. Unless they're, like, kind of green still, then I'm not not a fan. But, like, just if they're right, just, if they're fine, then, yeah, I don't have a problem with it. Although I will say, uh, we started ordering pizza with, like, a light sauce, like, not as much sauce, and I prefer it that way. I do. Right? <laughs> What's your name? Trent. I want to do it just to annoy first time at this point. Oh, man. 
hate tomato on pretty much everything except for pizza. Yeah, I hear you. You don't eat them, it's a texture thing. Okay, I gotcha. I gotcha, Chaz. Um, yeah, so Leonard was talking about the other day putting a little bit of maple syrup in your, like, biscuit gravy gravy. And I literally got a text from my brother that said, no F-word syrup in gravy. So now I want to make biscuits and gravy with... When he's around, just hit them, put some syrup in there and not tell him. <laughs> don't hate him, but don't like him. Exactly, Chuck. That's how I feel about him, too. John, what's going on? Howdy. How are you? I can tip my cap. <laughs> some people. I'm not doing that. <laughs> uh, I'm having too much fun with the straw hat today, chat. Way too much fun with it. I need like a Puma Plow logo up on the front there. Maybe I should get a sticker, one of my stickers, exclamation point merch, and just stick that thing right on there, you know? That would work, except for it has green in it. No, he's not listening right now, unless he's on early lunch at work. Uh, but he's at work today, so I am I should be safe to talk about stuff. Normally, I don't think he goes to lunch till like 3 o'clock, uh, Chaz, so we should be good. Good mood today? Who? I'm always in a... Uh, never mind. I'm not always in a good mood. How did your hoodie end up in California? Did you give it to your dad? That's a little weird. All right. Okay. So, chat. We are uh, done liming. Oh, do we want to lime 15? I don't know if we want a lime 15. Let me let me run out here and yeah, that's what I was thinking, Dave. I just looked at it like, eh, it might use some lime. Just run out here. Oh yeah, this is that says it's okay. Ah, we won't use a lot. Let's do it. Let's make it happen, Dave. You betcha. It won't use a ton, so I'll use a couple tons. Leonard, what's up? How's it going? What's poppin'? Oh, 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 here comes John. Let's go. Let's go. All right, Chuck, we'll catch you. Have a good one. Enjoy. Enjoy. All right. <laughs> Oh, gotcha, yes, gotcha. That's unfortunate. <laughs> that thing's a world traveler at this point then, huh? Well, good thing it's hot and you don't need it, right? <laughs> Guess that's that's the plus side, right? Look at look at the glass is half full kind of thing, you know? Um, the whole back of this is fake. What? There's no collision on the back of the spider. <laughs> uh, funny right there. Indiana to Cali. It's funny. That's amusing. The spider and them. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Had no idea. No collision on the back of this thing. You know what? I have noticed that you can kind of back it into buildings, so... Went right through it. Not real. It's 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 fake or something. That's weird. But Amelia, another one. Um, I mean, I don't have them. <laughs> That's not how that works. <laughs> it's not quite how that works. They're like made to order kind of thing, you know. I don't I don't have a stock of them laying around. Otherwise, I would, yeah. Your immersion, it's gone. Ruined junk. Am I destroying the crops? Not even up. How would I be destroying the crop, John? Hi, Dave. How's it going? <laughs> What's this? 
No, I'm not destroying the crop. The crop was just planted. Not sure what that was, but we'll go ahead and top up here. Oh, goodness me. Right. All right, let's go this way. Oh. Oh, okay. No, you're good, Dave. I got you, John. Now I understand the confusion. Okay. It's like, bro, we just planted last night. We haven't fast time yet. Now I'm just out here running down all of our crop to put a little lime on it. Got to get yield, you know? Forget the tramways. The, the tire tracks are, well, the track tracks. Ain't got no tires. Yeah, no, I'm, I'm just, you know, we just planted. It's all good. By the way, appreciate uh, appreciate you guys sticking in uh, last night, staying in and getting the jobs done. We got all the fertilizing done after stream last night, so that was really uh, really handy. I know four doesn't look at or a grass field, but they are fertilized, so they are kind of weird looking. I know, but that's what they require. So it was good to get that all done. You betcha. You betcha. But once we get done with lime, we can uh, go for a fast time and probably, I would say, uh, we'll have to herbicide tomorrow, I guess. Yeah, that'll be our next job probably is herbiciding. Not every field's going to need it, though, because I did work. I know I worked well. I didn't plow, though. We might have a lot of weeds to spray. And then after that is probably wheat harvest in our one uh, one wheat field that we have. But I'm not totally sure what's next. We'll see. We will see. It ain't got no gas. <laughs> you know, I thought about making the same joke. And then I was like, no, I can't do that. But I wanted to. I got Dave. I got you. I got you. Oh, oh, there we go. Maybe. You know, I was at, I took, we, uh, we mowed in town last week, Chaz. Last Thursday, dad and I, like, brought the lawnmower home and mowed. But on the way home, we stopped at the gas station. <laughs> and I almost sent you a video from the gas station, but I, my phone was in the truck, and I was, like, on the lawnmower, on the trailer, putting a lot of, like, gas in the lawnmower. And I was going to send you a video and be like, this is what you do before you mow. You fill up your lawnmower. <laughs> I got this spreader from Trent. I have no idea where he got it from. Uh, what are my favorite crops? I li I really like corn. Uh, even before the stoop, the the little song, I I really like corn. Oh, it was hilarious! Hilarious! I've run out. I've run our big lawnmower out of gas a couple times now. Yeah, not this year. Not this year, but in, uh, last year when we first got our lawnmower, uh, I wasn't used to it yet and, like, how long I could run. I'd just be out mowing, 60 and zero turn, blop, that's it. <laughs> like, oh, I need to switch tanks. And the sad thing is it has a digital fuel gauge, but the digital fuel gauge is, like, kind of, it's almost, like, behind you. It's kind of awkward to see from the seat, and so I never look at it. So, oh. Uh -oh. I haven't tried corn in Farm Sim 22. We have some, uh, we have a couple fields growing of it right now, actually. Gotcha. Yeah, it was something like that. You're right, Chess. Yeah, it happens. It's got the juice. <laughs> oh, you filled it up before Bowie, did you still? You had a lot of mowing to do then, huh? Mom did the same thing the other day. Maybe, maybe you need to have like a pit stop halfway through, like get off, get you, get you a drink, let the lawnmower cool down a little bit, refill it with, with gas, you know, have a, have a pit stop halfway through. Have, have somebody come out with a yellow flag, wave a yellow flag, you know, maybe throw a caution, you know, not a bad idea Just saying. There we go. I was like, is that thing not on? Oh, goodness. 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 Oh, goodness
at this. That's funny. That's the, um, I don't want to say problem with like, uh, yard tractors like that is you have to go every which direction. You know, with the zero turn, you can just like zip and go and you know, so yeah. 30 inch or 30 cent zero turn. Nice fire shadow. Nice. I, I love zero turns. I I really do. I'm so glad that like we we always had a decent. Well, for the last like 15 years or something, we've had one. We had our X mark. We still have our X mark. Haven't like started it all year, but, like once maybe. Uh, but that gravely is just like. Uh. Oh no! If your dad bought it for you, heck no! Heck no! Heck no. I enjoy getting a, uh, a a tractor out and doing a little bit of mowing once in a while. It's fun. Break out our John Deere 111 and do some mowing with that once in a while. Heck yeah. One. Holy cow, Chaz. Dang. I wouldn't complain either. <laughs> oh, man. Yeah, I would not complain either. Not at all. Nobody's that thing just keeps moving and nobody's in it. I'm a little concerned. <laughs> I'm a little concerned. Uh, I think so. I think so, Chaz. Yeah. Kind of open the top. Oh, it's Z to open the top. That's what John's saying. Okay. Oh, by the way. We discovered something last night with that new truck. When Plugger comes in here, we gotta have a chat about that. Whenever Plugger comes in here, we gotta we gotta have a chat about that. There's something very strange that that truck does, but I understand why it does it. But it's weird at the same time. And we discovered it last night right after stream, or, or Bear discovered it actually during stream, but didn't say anything till after, which is totally fine. And and now like it's like that's kind of weird. But it kind of makes sense at the same time, so it's all good. Just something interesting. But anyway, that's fine. And you know, speaking of like, yeah, we have a we have a new truck we're trying out. Okay, bear found it. Not. Okay, Bear discovered it, and then I did the I did the research to confirm, okay? Because you had already left the game, sir. So I confirmed. I confirmed it, all right? <laughs> oh, goodness. Captain Vapor, what's going on? How are you doing today? Welcome in. Welcome in. All right, we are done liming. We're not liming anymore, right? I think we're done. We're gonna we're gonna call it there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're good. I think. I think we're good. Let's go put it away to the barn. To the barn. I'm doing great. Doing great. Having a good day. Looks like John's ready to do some uh, herbicide. You want to unload? Oh. There you go, Dave. It's like you want to unload what? It does make sense to unload, though, yeah. Yes, sir. Because I don't know what we're going to be using it for next. Fertilizer or lime? Probably lime, but you never know. We do have an awful lot of, of pellets uh, fertilizer laying around, so. Doesn't hurt to use it up. Not at all. All right. So let's back this in the shed. I'm out. Plugger, what's going on? How are you? Welcome in. I have a question. Or I have a, I have a, something to show you, Plugger. Arthur. Yeah, I can back it through the shed. Yeah, true. Plugger, I got something to show you. It's not, I'm not complaining. It's just something that Bear noticed. 
We're gonna pin this one on bear, okay? Westy just resubscribed for five months. Uh, Puma West plo cap, Puma plo high. Westy, welcome back for five months. Do appreciate the resub. How are you? Welcome in. 16x map. No, holy cow. All right. So, plugger. This trailer and that trailer on that truck are the same trailer. They're both the lizard uh, hopper bottom out of the mod hub. They're the same trailer. Okay. And I can't show you on there because, well, you know, the help menu's all garbled up. Anyway, to open the cover on this trailer is N is a Nancy, right? As it should be. Or as it is just, you know, informs them, right? N. N Nancy, right? No, it does drink, yeah. I'm just saying we'll probably use it for live next, but I don't know. This truck, same trailer, and does not work. It's Z as in zebra. Same trailer. Because, and this makes sense, N puts the hood down. So I'm hitting uh, J right now, and then I hit N and it does the hood, which does make sense because that's the mouse control on the keyboard. It totally makes sense. It's just funny that this truck, even though I'm selected on the trailer, it hijacks N for the hood. So it's just something Bear noticed last night. He thought the trailers were different or something. And I was like, oh, it's the same trailer. And uh, so it's not, not really an issue. It's just something that we noticed. That's it. It's not an issue. It's not a problem. It's just something that we noticed. It was kind of like, now wait a minute. That's the same trailer. Why is it Z? Uh, and it does the same thing with the convey all. The convey all on that semi is, is N and on this one it's Z. Which is like, huh? <laughs> but it's kind of funny. So, yeah. I, I don't know, Sean. It's something in the truck, I guess. It's weird. Okay. Oh, we got an Amazon truck versus mailbox, y'all. Oh, no. Oh, no, no, no. should open with the mouse only well it does open with the mouse as well in addition but you know like with a loader tractor you know m k n and j act as your mouse controls so i mean you can use a, you can operate a loader tractor with your with your keyboard you don't have to use a mouse it's just kind of you know kind of interesting it, it double it i don't know arson what's up you like my hat pretty sick right it's such a nice day out here. I just figured, you know, why not wear a straw hat? <laughs> What's popping? I, you know, honestly, uh, plugger, I haven't messed with it enough yet. Um, bear was running uh, trailers around last night with it, though. Yeah. Nice to your buds. No, Carson, it's nice haircut. Get it right. <laughs> That's what everybody else says. <laughs> Oh, man. Uh, but yes, I, I do believe it is pulling a trailer around just fine for us, Plugger. Yes. I do believe so. My God, look at the wall in that chat chat. Jeez. Jeez. I'm here for it. I'm here for it, chat. That's awesome. That's going to be some money. Just saying. That is going to be some cash, y'all. All right, let's grab those. Turn around. All right, um, John and Dave, are you guys ready for fast time? Or is there pressing matters that we have to tend to in the homestead here? Like maybe the lime maker? <laughs> the rest of the stuff I'm not too worried about right now. Lime maker would be one to check. It needs stones. Are we out of stones? I bet we're out of stones. They're here somewhere. We are out of stones. Okay. Oh, you know, you're 
Just feeding chickens. Okay. And four. Okay. I tell you what, Plugger, I need to take that truck to uh, Hillview and see if it'll pull a trailer up that hill. Because <laughs> that was the one we struggled us with more than anything. <laughs> Was pulling a trailer up that darn hill on Hillview. Which, by the way, I think Stevie put out a like a teaser or something for a new map. I was laying in bed last night and I got an alert on my phone and I was like, ah, I should watch that. And I I watched it, but I don't really remember. I don't remember what it was called or anything. I was I was kind of like half asleep. So yeah, I thought that was interesting. But that would be funny to take it to Hillview and see if it'll pull that uh, pull that hill. That hill, hill was ridiculous, for the record. That hill was so steep, it was crazy. Alright, chickens looking alright. Those cows, those cows. It's crazy that... 700,000 straws. Well, they'll never be full on straw, never. Uh, sheep could use some silage in a minute, if you guys don't mind. Y'all don't mind. April showers, y'all. You know what that means. May, May flowers. Or something. Pumpkin, watermelon, and tomatoes. I think we're solid all those, Dave. May weeds, pretty much, Sonya. Or, uh, Carson, sorry. You with the name in blue. Tranquil Waters by Stevie. Ooh. Ooh. That's a cool map name. Uh, I'm assuming there's a lot of water on that map, right? I'm assuming. Uh, Dave, if you want to... Uh, oh, you know... Wait a minute, wait a minute. Yeah, we're supposed to sell wool in April, aren't we? Yeah, I forgot about that. We need to sell wool right now. Well, I guess I'll load it all up and head out with it, huh? Uh, if you guys want to grab those other trailers and change them to wool, I would appreciate it. Let's, let's team up and get it done. Just to walk around the home said, yeah, okay, that's kind of what I remember. Like I said, I was, I was more than half asleep when I watched the video last night. <laughs> Uh, welcome in everybody. Hope everybody's having a good uh, Tuesday. Tuesday. I don't remember what day it was. And I can hear noise outside my house. Let me uh, see what's going on real quick. Nothing. Absolutely nothing. Okay. Probably the neighbor. I did hear noisy guys lawnmower this morning when I was laying in bed, so. I don't know if he got his yard done or not, but like, hopefully. Just saying. Uh, chat, we have 242 pallets in this building. <laughs> oh, God. I don't know how many it lets me get out at once. I'd say that many, maybe one more. Maybe not. Pretty good. I thought you could only do one row at a time. So I was pretty happy about multiple rows here, you know? Oh, of course. Oh God, don't mind me. Just two kid wool pallets everywhere. I want it to fill me up. Fill me up. It is not about filling this trailer up all the way. There we go. Should be 50,000, but I have some partial pallets, so that's good enough. I might have made a mess over here. Don't mind me. Don't mind the mess. All right. 
Dave, good catch, by the way, on selling the wool. I completely forgot. Okie dokie, we're going to we'll sell point by Stevie, I guess. Gotcha. Let's go. Maybe it's the loud neighbor that I can hear now. I don't know who it is. But he's out there making noise. Let's put it that way. Which is pretty common around here, but you know. Okay. All right, so I got 48,000 wool. And everybody knows this trailer gets tippy. Ah. Very, very tippy. And uh, when it's full. So that's fun. That's a good time. Oh, I got you, Dave. Okay. I should have, like, realized what was going on there because the building was full. The building hasn't been full this entire time. The building was basically full. So it's like, obviously, it's time to sell if the building's full, right? Obviously. That's all right. Oh, hey. It's Carson. Hi, Carson. Oh, man. Bats. Look at our beautiful wheat crop out there, isn't it? Isn't it marvelous? Our grass. Hopefully we'll be mowing that again today. Because I don't actually know how much grass we ended up with last night. I have no idea. Guess I could check. Uh, oh, 2.6. Oh, heck yes. That was that was a lot off that field then, wasn't there? Wow. The sad thing is we could probably haul all of that to the like haul and fast time a little bit and haul it again and fast time a little bit. Like all that can probably go into cows right now. Like every last little bit of that. But that's okay. That's just because the robot has such a capacity that uh, it makes a lot of TMR. Makes a lot, a lot of TMR. So, yeah. How does this work? Because isn't this our spinnery? Yeah, that's not giving us any money. We're not, no, we're not doing that. I, oh, okay. That doesn't give us any money. That puts it in to make, like, uh, we're taking into a sell everything then. That's our only sell everything left. That's in the homestead, guys. I believe this. Is that the one by the chickens? What base game silo can hold grass? Uh, that would be the hayloft. This bad boy right here. Uh, this thing will hold grass right here. Two, so it holds uh, grass, straw, hay. I want to say something else too, but basically it holds 250,000 total. So yeah. That's kind of weird, chat. But yeah. Oh, I didn't know, realize that bear. So you were hauling as we were dumping it. Oh my goodness. Wow. So we had like way, way, way more. Uh, is what you're saying. That's insane. Uh, hey, I didn't know that. Carson, that sounds like fun.
interesting. Very, very interesting. Okay. Well, at least this will be a fast selling process because there's no commute once I uh, get up to your, get back up here to the homestead. There won't be a commute. So uh, we just made some more fabric. That's all we did. Not a big deal, but it might be like five years before we get all that wool uh, processed through uh, down there at the old spinnery and tailor shop. That's all right, I guess. It is what it is. Uh, unfortunately. All right. Oh, I didn't even know we still had that one sitting there. Yeah, we need to get rid of that. But yes, it is. It's up here, John. Actually, we need to start saving our eggs, too, at some point, but... That's neither here or there, honestly. Oh, gosh. All right. Oh, come on. Take them all out of the trailer. Let's go. There we go. There we go. All right. We nailed it. Nailed it. Go get some more. Oh boy. We have so much wool. Chat, we're not going to be poor today. I mean, give me like five minutes. We probably will be poor again, but you know. That's okay. See, it takes forever. Okay. You gotta wait for the sound. Getting out all the smidge ones. That works. <laughs> Almost a full time job in here, just, you know, pushing the buttons. I didn't realize how long it took to actually, like, spawn them. Interesting. Just speeze past you here. Old pallets, don't mind me. Right. <laughs> Dave laid it over. It happens. Happens to the best of us. Right. By the way, they, they uh, we were spreading manure last night. And by we, I mean, it wasn't me. Uh, but we used all of it. It's kind of crazy. I don't know how much we actually started with, but all of it was gone. Uh, thanks for the follow. Appreciate you. Welcome in. How's it going? Welcome. On in. Oh, stop truck. I ain't got no brakes. All right. There we go. All right. There's our million dollars, anyway. May not have as much as uh, the hope, but that's all right. Money's money. We'll probably buy... Uh, I don't know what we're going to buy today. Maybe another set of mowers would be good. That would uh, speed up the process quite a bit. Oh, no. Oh no, it's doing that thing. I can't get the trigger to work anymore. Oh, I got it. 
Hey, it should be right here, and for some reason it just wasn't working. It should be up. Okay. That was weird. Alright, I should have the rest of the guys. I'd be good here. Uh, Dave, do we have an abundance? You said something about the greenhouse stuff. Do we need to get rid of that just to get rid of it now? Because if that's the case, then that's fine. We can just haul it or sell it out of sell everything or whatever. Just, uh, just to get rid of it. I'm cool with that. Right now, I don't think we have a use for the pumpkins or the tomatoes. Uh, really, I think the only one that we have a use for is strawberries. Right now, anyway. But actually, we could go turn off the other stuff just to turn it off. Alright, so there's $1.4 million. Let's go. I'm here for it. Go back here. See what's up with the, the greenhouse stuff. We got chicken. Alright. We got here. So the strawberries, we can leave those, yeah. Okay, there's not as much back here as I thought. Okay. That's fine. Tomatoes. They all oddly look the same. Wow. Oh. Oh, well, there's the pumpkins. Look at the pumpkins. Those are pie pumpkins. We grow those every year. Those would be good inside of a pumpkin cannon, for the record. Nice shape, you know. Yeah. They're, they're all pretty much the same size. $132,000 for that load of stuff. Let's go. That's not bad bad at all. Like in the maker bear or like in storage or like in the barns? That's the real question. Alright. Head off. I want to check the sale barn too. Nothing we need. Okay. Uh, cause in this, that's since last night. Well, uh, in here, there is a lot, 400 plus thousand, uh, in this barn, which this barn we're trying to empty. There's still 50,000 there. So trying to empty that barn kind of, I just pull the trigger on that barn one of these days and, and let it go. It's not telling me yet. All right. All right. We have over a million in storage. Oh, man. We can need to go haul a lot of beats around, too. Actually, let's do that real quick. Uh, I think, are we out of sunflowers again? Is that our, is that our problem? Which is why, oh, now we have a few sunflowers left. Okay. All right, chat, let's grab really fast. Actually, uh, let's fast time a day. Because then we can divide and conquer a little bit, okay? Let's fast time the one day that we need. The rest of the day that we need here. Uh, so we can have weeds. And then uh, we can spray weeds. And I'm going to go like do some hauling around uh, factories too. All at the same time. How about that? We'll divide and conquer a little bit. Okie dokie. Oh, Bear, you'll be happy to know, and I know this is weird that I'm directing this at Bear, uh, but Bear, you'll be happy to know I've ordered a new pair of shoes. In an Instagram post a while back, you can see my shoes while I was mowing. An Instagram-like story post, right? And Bear commented how beat up my shoes looked. And I've felt self-conscious about it ever since. They're really not that beat up, but like, whatever. 
And uh, so I've, I've ordered a new pair of shoes. And I thought of you, Bear, when I hit purchase, okay? Just for the record. I hope I can run in them, you know? Wait. I'm going to plow the bottom. I don't know, Carson. Uh, I kind of like having the separate fields because with us having the animals, you know, we kind of need, like, different things uh, every year. Like, multiple things and not just, like, one big field of XYZ. You know what I mean? So, I, I don't know. I don't know. We'll see. They're not white New Balance. No, they are New Balance, but they're not white. No, no. I I do have a pair of those, though. I didn't realize they were, like, the shoe that everybody made fun of. So after, I, like, once people started making fun of them, I just, like, I quit wearing them. But I have them. <laughs> I definitely do have them. You betcha. I don't even know what that is. Uh, we're one day per month. Carson, if you want to go, like, take a load of sugar beets down to the beet cutter thingy and then take the cut beets to the sugar mill. I know you don't know where any of that stuff is in this map, but you'll find it. Yeah, we, we play one day months is all we, uh, all we ever play. Chat, why is there no weeds? Oh, I gotta turn weeds on. That's why there's no weeds. All right. Why is there no weeds? Because weeds are turned off on my map. That's why. That's why. <laughs> no, they don't light up. <laughs> I wish they did, though. Low key. Low key, I wish they did. <laughs> uh, that would be awesome. I'm not cool enough to have light up shoes, okay? All the barbecue dads wear. I'm more of a like you know uh, New Balance like white shoe with the grass stains kind of kind of dad. That's the dad I want to be someday, you know. Is there a mod where you can pull a weed with your hands? I have no idea. <laughs> oh, Alex, what's up? Yeah, weeds do not uh, work right when they're turned off, right? Uh, Z, zebra, Carson. It's an issue. It's not. It's not an issue. It's the thing with that truck. Z zebra, or maybe not. <laughs> you want me to do it? There you go. <laughs> Sometimes you leave one weed in the field and it drives you crazy. <laughs> Grass stained Skechers kind of that. I don't wear Skechers. No. Right, Leonard? <laughs> I actually kind of have a family tie to Skechers, so like, yeah, I'm not gonna. Kind of. But I don't wear them, no. But yeah. Hey, yo, Dave. Uh, sugar beets, if we have any, Carson. Oh, uh, we don't have any. Uh, b -b 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 then probably nothing from storage, Carson, actually. Come down here, follow me. Follow me! Come with me. And you'll be a world of OSHA violations. Come down here. Come here. I guess I could just unmute TeamSpeak and talk to you. It'd probably be easier, wouldn't it? Probably would be easier. But yeah. Arson. Is that? 
Hi. Hi. Uh, so you're coming down here to this uh, beat cutter. Okay. The sick, sick beat cutter. Uh, south of four. Okay. Yep. You don't mind. This truck goes slow. It goes 55 miles an hour. Mm, so slow. <laughs> Actually, John, we should have, yes. Uh, okay. Oh, God, here he comes. Chat, look out. So you're going to fill up with beets. I don't actually know. Okay, what's here at the dairy? We haven't made anything at the dairy yet. How is that the thing? How is that a thing, chat? Why don't we have any uh, 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 milkshakes or butter? Why is that not like... Oh, we didn't turn it on, chat. That would be why. Where's this going? Uh, I didn't turn it on. Uh, we should have yogurt though, right? Does yogurt not spawn? Where am I taking this? Uh, that's going down to uh, the sugar factory. Uh, it's behind us a ways. Okay. I guess I'm not needed here then. Never mind. <laughs> All right, it's down here somewhere. Follow me. I'll stop at it. I think it's like all the way on the other end of the map. Oh, that truck sounds so good, doesn't it? Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. It sounds better now that they nerfed the jink rigs. Because it used to be so loud. That's all right. Okay. I guess I'll go move fabric and clothing around then, I guess. Oh, we should have sold the clothing that we had, too, by the way. When we sold the wool. Kind of forgot about that one. But that's all right, I guess. I could just go grab it now and sell it just to sell it. There's just a fair bit down there, I believe. Might as well. I think he's catching me, chat. All right, so this is the flour mill. So I believe it's this building, this next building right here, Carson, on your left. Oh, there's product there. Uh, okay. Well, I kind of did want to go in here, actually. Thank you. Oh. <laughs> uh, wasn't quite wanting that, but yeah, it works. Okay, so sugar mill. Wait, yeah, we, uh, we I think we got this all backwards, where we turned on the ones we don't have, and the ones we have are turned off. Kind of interesting. Okay, so sugar mill, we're gonna be making uh, sugar, obviously. All this other stuff off that we can't actually make right now, but we can make that. Not making that. Okay, so what's actually spawned here at the... So we have sugar and we have our icing sugar, which basically is powdered sugar, if you ask me. Um, So where do those need to go, chat? <laughs> to the bakery? Dairy, maybe? We need sugar at the dairy, okay, for chocolate. That's fine. And then at the bakery, probably, for the rest of this, yeah. I guess. Alright, so let's uh, load this up. Alright, let's back up. Get that other row. Come on, now. There we go. All right, can we go grab those other pallets while we're at this? That's what I was thinking, Barely. Yeah, the bakery. Um, hey, there's a fair amount of icing in there still, though. I would think it would spawn as we sit here, but I could be wrong. Unless we're in the way.
But I would think more pallets would spawn, no? Top of the hour, maybe? I guess not. That's fine. Whatever. Not a big deal. Not a big deal. All right, let's go grab the wool while we're here, the clothing. Grab all this stuff real good while we're here. Oh, you're good there. It's never, never bad to have a second like opinion, even though I've like looked at it, but it never hurts. You are good. All good, man. That's why we were talking about it last night. All this stuff's going to be set to distributing, like, probably. And not too far in the future, because it's too much to keep up with sometimes. A lot of this pallet needs to go there, and that pallet, it's, it gets to be too much. So we'll probably put it all in distributing at some point. Which we make less money then, but uh, who cares to a point, you know? Who cares? Rats. Put our clothing up. Come on. Rats. There we go. We have a nice mixed use truck right now. We got sugar and clothing. Because those go together, right? You don't. Okay. That's, at least we have auto load and we're not out here, you know, trying to use forklifts. Because, um. No. No, thank you. Alright, to the bakery, which I believe is right up here. I, I, I need to figure all this out still. It's kind of hard to remember everything. Hello. Hi. How you going? I saw my life flash before my eyes. That Carson was going to kill me. Or sorry, not Chuck. My bad. I don't know why. Why do you pick on Chuck Carson? Huh? That's the real question of the day. Same. All right. Bake cream. Yeah, I would agree, John. I would agree. What else needs hauled around? I'm not 100% sure right now, person. Be honest with You've you. not wanted a Baja Blast. Be bear 0313 cheered X100. Hey, John. You got some sweet threads there. Where'd you get them? Oh, uh, Bear, it's a good thing you're a dad, because, uh, yeah, appreciate the bits. Sean, I talked about that earlier. I have one. The problem is it has green on it, though, so that would look weird. So where do I go with this other uh, stuff? Icing sugar stuff. Where does that go? Can we just sell that? Probably. Because the bakery doesn't hold it. Or the sorry, the dairy doesn't hold it. The bakery also does not hold it. So I'm assuming that's just gonna get sold and possibly turned off, right? Possibly turned off as well. <laughs> wow, Infinity, what's up? Uh, okay, so for right now, I think we're just going to go back to the sugar mill and uh, let's disable that for now because, yeah, if it doesn't go anywhere, what's the point of having it? I'm sure there is something, but we just don't, we don't have it, whatever it is, we don't have it, so. 
All right, so where is the high price for clothing right now? I know it's not the right time of year, but uh, we still get 30 grand for it. Sell everything. Sell everything, chickens, okay. Let's go. Let's go. Sean, maybe I should put the pie face sticker on there. Oh, I finally got my uh, my uh, Starship patch, Carson. Yeah. Finally yesterday. Hmm. I had to put the Starship sticker on there. <laughs> Isn't there green on it, though? On the sticker? The Starship one? Yeah. I don't know. Sean, that kind of scared me, not going to lie. I don't know. Might be. It was. I am. I don't remember. Or is the different person's patch maybe too? I don't know. I don't know. Trent has them all. That's all I know. I just can't wait for that thing like uh, in the third quarter this year to show up. My first pizza SpaceX merch. Anyway. Can't wait for it. All right, let's hit uh, sell everything up here. Just to get rid of what we have. How do you open the other side, chat? There's a way to open the other side of the trailer, but I don't remember what it is. And the help menu is not going to tell me. Don't let's don't tell me to look in the help menu. It's not going to help. The pallets are falling over. No, I'm going to spill the sugar, chat. I guess we can open. I know we can open the back door. That's all we had to do. Okay. Just trying to make sure we can see in the trailer to see if it's empty. That's all. Start punching buttons. I mean, pretty much. Yeah. Usually that works. Yeah. Most of the time that does work. All right, I think we're done moving uh, moving pallets right now. I think. And Carson's moved the uh, sugar beets for us. The cut beets, that is. Um, let's just start at the top and go down. That is good. Uh, we're not actually doing anything with any of that that's fine whatever uh the tomatoes we're gonna turn those off for now and just grow uh strawberries out of this one because that's all that we need right now that one's good that one's good we're not doing anything there not really doing anything with that uh we didn't Hang on, we hauled stuff to the flour mill last night. And it only has a little bit. Okay. I guess we haven't really fast time since last night. That's what it is, probably. Okay, so when that's done, then yeah, okay. That's fine. Um Oh, I should have hauled some of that sugar to the dairy as well, by the way. Okay, sugar needs to go to the dairy as well. Okay, but we're making stuff now, y'all. We're making stuff, so that's good. Okay, flour mill's fine. That's fine. Sugar mill's going to be making sugar from cut beets. Are you going to buy another for forage wagon, Riggy said, maybe? Uh, I said something about moors, didn't I? Yeah. So we're using just the other, the Toby head Morse now. Mm. Uh, because we have so much grass that actually is faster to just mow with tractors. 
um, I don't know if you've seen our grass field now, but it's kind of a I've seen it. It's kind of a thing now, you know. Mm -hmm. Uh, but yeah, we can buy uh, we can buy more. So we're actually mowing and bailing again. Oh, nice. I know it's everybody's favorite thing to do. Are you putting the bales straight into storage then? Yeah. It's just the most efficient way to haul the, the quantity, you know? Mm hmm And you know, chat, we're only like two tractors away from having the deer collection. <laughs> two more tractors, and we have all the John Deers in the game. They're like Pokemans. Got to catch them all. Just saying. All right, while the guys are uh, spraying weeds, what else do we have to do? Are you going down to get those moors? Yeah. Um, I mean, I guess I can haul stuff to the cows because they can always use uh, always use stuff. So that's fine. What happens after we collect the John Deers? Um. Uh, then we uh, we evolved to uh, modded John Deers. I don't know. They are Chuck, right? We'll start selling one by one, getting a different brand. <laughs> so we have all the different brand. Right. Right. Then we'll do the same thing. Westbourne. Okay, Dave. But no case because case sucks. Oh. I hope Jacob heard that. Jacob's at work. Phone clip and send it to him. <laughs> so I don't quite understand because we had these cows for a while, but like they never did anything. I think we're just going to sell those cows and be done with it, you know? We're just going to sell them. Throwing it out there. Just going to sell them, chat. An imaginary badge, yes. That's what I've always wanted. They seem sad. Hamburger and steaks, let's go. Just in time for the, the holiday weekend, right? Right, right. Wow. Wow. I mean, it's called a case quad track, right? Nobody calls it an international harvester quad track. Nobody calls it that. Huh? H quad track. I know, but nobody says the IH, honestly. It's a case. The case quad track. The case Magnum. Yeah. The, the whole international harvester, that, that name died like a long time ago. Let's just be honest for a minute here. Your steering's not turned on. There we go. Jerkin zip across the yard with this truck. I'll say that much. Holy cow. I just, I like the brakes on the truck. They work well. You might be up against the windshield, you know, <laughs> trying to put yourself back in the seat, but. Does the seat stay the same for everyone? Oh, did you move it? Yeah. <laughs> I like that. If you look out the window, like all you saw was like the top of my head. <laughs> if you look out the window, look at your hands on the steering wheel too. I have a little boy driving a big truck. Look at your hands on the steering wheel. Yeah. You got like quadruple jointed wrists. That's farm stuff. No, that's not the truck. Don't worry. Oh my goodness. <laughs> the race breaks, you betcha. I think it thro he throws a boat anchor out the window is what he does. Because, man. Pretty, pretty fast, but I'm not complaining. It's good. I tend to overshoot everything with the other trucks, so. 
Might as well actually, you know, stop with his truck. So I don't actually need to be hauling this because they do have uh, 2 million mixed rations, but I might as well haul some, some stuff here because I got time to kill right now, so might as well. Might as well set up the rodeo here and get it done. Oh, oh, can't leave before we're empty. There we go. Let's go. Turbo speed. 55 is a good speed for a truck, I feel like. I feel like it's pretty solid. Yeah, not, not bad. But the guys should be done out there. Uh, they got a field and a half to go. So they're they're rocking it. When they get done, we'll uh, continue with the fast time. A bad show. What's going on? Welcome in, welcome in. A field and a half. Yeah, you're good, John. All good. I don't know what's going to be first, mowing or uh, wheat harvest. In a minute. I just realized who did this. <laughs> it's a 6120M <laughs> on that crow trailer. How does that handle that? <laughs> it's good. Oh, it's all good here, man. All good. How does that tractor handle that trailer? That's the real question, chat. All right. Straw is full. Let's go. up straw in here right up uh, we probably won't fill this up but we'll go ahead and empty our straw storage it's a yard tractor with all the horses <laughs> i just can't believe it moves the trailer honestly that's crazy but hey if it works if it if it fits it ships right so it's all good it's just kind of funny. I didn't think that tractor would handle that trailer, but hey, it works. It works. It works. It works. That's a normal thing. Yep. Cows phase through walls. It happens in real life. You've never seen it. Whole load of silage also. Oh my goodness, Dave. Oh, 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 oh. You're not supposed to hit the flower beds. Okay. Note to self. Don't hit the flower bed. That's all right. So we probably need to make sure we plant another field in, in, in wheat or barley or oats or something we get straw from. Probably just do wheat. Uh, so we have in the the barn that I'm messing with, we have 800 cows. Uh, we have a few other cows, but we're probably I'm gonna probably sell them actually. There goes cows. They're spooky. Spooky. Yeah. So what we did is the barn on my left here is what comes with the map, and right now we have a few cows there, but. I like the barn on the right a lot more. It holds a lot more of uh, food, basically. It holds more food. So you have to fill it up less often, basically. Um, so that's that's really nice, because right now those cows... See, the cows that I'm messing with are Holsteins. Uh, 800 of them in this barn, and they have 
almost 2 million. Basically, that's your TMR number for inside the barn, uh, which is awesome. So you can see they hold a whole lot more of everything. This barn has been modified to hold a lot. And actually, the little robot out here, this, this guy, this guy has been modified to hold a ton. So basically, every time it mixes food, it goes through like the outside storage worth of stuff or only it has to mix food like twice to go through it all. But it holds a lot, a lot, a lot. So it's actually, it's actually pretty nice because uh, you don't have to fill it up as often. So uh, the other barns that we had, they, uh, they, they, they're, they're fine. They're the ones that come with the map. They're fine. Uh, dang it, Bobby, I did it again. Uh, but they just don't hold enough. So you would only be able to go like a day on fast time and then have to fill them up. And it's, it's fine. It just gets annoying. Same time. Messing with, I'm messing with cows. Hey, bye, Carson. Have a good day. Or not, Chuck. Hey, bye. Uh, I don't know. Yo, Barry. I don't know what you're getting at, but I'm just gonna stop talking about cows. <laughs> I don't know what you're on about, but I'm just going to stop, okay? Okay, thanks for playing. Come on. You know, Barry, your mind is in a, in a, like, are they, that's not Yulberry, it's Scott. Dang it. I'm talking to Yulberry, it's Scott. Do you guys both have pink names? Sorry. Hey, Scott's just as bad as Yulberry, though, in my defense. Just as bad. My bad. Hi, right, Scott. How you doing today, by the way? Uh, welcome in. My bad. I don't know why I just... <laughs> I just... I saw you very there, and I know it says oh, Scott, but like... Uh, oh, Yulberry, I appreciate the humor as well. Just saying, I do. I laugh at it. As long as I'm not the target of it, I think it's hilarious. Did it, did we get any beef? No. So those we had those cows like fed and everything. Well, obviously, they're not right now, but they have reproduced or anything. So I don't know. I don't know what the deal is with them. Honestly, I think we're just going to sell them and be done with it. Uh, eventually, we'll probably go to 1,600 dairy cows, though. That's probably what we'll do eventually. So I wouldn't mind selling selling those cows off and then replacing the barn today. Because we have some money. And then... We're not ready to buy the, the other cows, though, I feel like. I, mean, I feel like we need to hold off on buying 800 more cows. God, I need to learn how to drive. Dang. So, yeah. But I'm trying to empty our straw storage right now into this barn. I mean, they'll use it eventually, so... It's all good. Million straw... God, how many millions does this building hold? <laughs> we need to set up a conveyor belt from storage to uh, to bring straw back here. And just let it eat. I was actually thinking about the little uh, little dump truck deal from... Uh, per or, uh, not Precision. The Platinum Edition. <laughs> I was thinking about that. I was like, I should get that on here and set up course play for Holland. All in straw. That would be funny. Just turn it on and let it eat. Let it go. That's all right. Pull an Elsa, you know. Let it go. Why does my steering keep getting turned off on this trailer? I don't understand that one. <laughs> 